you know, secondary takrade and flooding. People now people have become smarter. Even though it's not 6 p.m., but people have closed their shops and they've left. They've gone back to their homes. Over here is the central part, so I mean you can get a couple of people hanging around here buying and selling. But if you if you hit the main street, even cars, you can't see a whole lot of them there. They are really packed because they know the implication. If they hang around here and it continues to rain for some time, they know how it can turn out. Uh, somewhere around UBA, it's worse. People are still, I don't know whether they are whisking or, or um, what's the English word? <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> so I just want to go around the circle and see the situation over there. The guy, he wants to know what's happening, what I'm holding. But over here in the central market, so business is still happening around here. Why not? But I do understand that somewhere around Malcolm Road, when it rains, it also gets flooded. I want to go and see what's happening around there. But like I'm saying, because here is a central market, people are still doing buying and selling over there. But if you get to the main street, like the actual road, you cannot really see a lot of people there. They, even cars. And people have also closed their shops. They've gone to their homes. They want to save themselves trouble. Yeah, bro. So, and I think it's a, it's a nice thing. Where do you live? How is the flooding situation over there? Have you been able to control it? Is it normal over there? Do you have things under control? Or it's worse like Keten. Keten is really worse. Very, very worse. When I got there, I was just using that route to secondly. And I happened upon it. It wasn't a fancy. But over here, it's flooded though, but I mean, people have still been able to do something about it. So yeah, the rain has stopped for about an hour now, so it's reasonable that we are no longer seeing the, the flood around here. But what I think is that um, uh, some of these things are caused by our dumping. You can see on the floor how we dump trash. I believe if we find a way to manage how we, we dump things, we can have a headway around this thing because the gutters are there, just that they are choked. Very, very choked. All over there. The gutters are choked. So we need to um, find a way to to go about how we dump trash, especially rubber. They are the things that get into the gutters. They block the drainage and it becomes an issue. So around Malcolm Road, I think everything is fine here. Yeah, but we still have um, to take precautions because you wouldn't know when you'll be in town and then it will come all the way hard and then you find yourself wanting. Yeah, let me know where you live and the situation over there. I will really appreciate. La, 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 la.